Hey guys, yes I'm back, <laughs> yes you can look forward to your regular daily videos starting tomorrow, oh yeah. Uh, I wanted to do a, an update video to, start to you know, like, tell you that I'm back, I want to explain to you like why I've been away so long, and I want to tell you what's coming up because there's some really exciting stuff coming up over the next uh, few months. Can you believe it's like only two months to Christmas? So yeah, I'm going to be continuing some of the old series. I'll tell you about that. There are a bunch of new games that I want to get into. There is even a, an RPG game that I'm really excited about, and I want to tell you all about that. But before we get into all of the details about that, I'm back. So I've got a question for you. Well, I hope you are, because I tell you now, I am really, really happy to be back. Okay, so I've been away for what, like six weeks now, and uh, I'm, so I know some of you guys have been kind of annoyed with me. So, so what the hell happened? Okay, well, let's go back to um, City Skylines After Dark was coming up, and uh, I took a couple of days break, kind of like not for any particular reason, and then I thought, you know what, Skylines, I'm going to be getting a preview copy of Skylines After Dark in like uh, probably a week or so, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to take a little break. And I'm going to have a week off, and I'm going to come into After Dark, like, really, you know, refreshed and pumped and ready to go. And then, uh, I didn't get my copy of, uh, my preview copy of After Dark. Uh, and I was waiting day after day, and it was getting closer and closer to the release date. And I thought, you know, I'm not going to bug the guys at, at Paradox, I'll just wait, I'll be patient. And then I saw, like, a, like I think it was, like, the day before, or two days before, uh, release or something, that, um... The other YouTubers uh, releasing videos, and I thought, what the hell? So I actually, I sent a kind of a, a, a pissy email to uh, to Paradox and said, like, where the hell's my preview copy? And I got this mail back saying, uh, oops, sorry, uh, we kind of missed your name off the list, and uh, we're really sorry. We'll get it to you like right now, which they did, and they sent it to me, and I just got kind of pissed off, and instead of just kind of getting over it and getting on with it. I just got more and more annoyed, uh, and I saw, I, I watched a couple of videos uh, by people like my good friend Fluxtrans, and I was like, oh, you know, I'm kind of really, like, really annoyed, and it just got worse and worse, and like, a week turned into two weeks, and instead of getting, just getting over it, I just got more annoyed, and then, after about two and a half weeks or so, of, of just like sitting there, and I was watching videos, and reading stuff, and just being annoyed, I suddenly realized like how silly it was and then I got kind of embarrassed about how silly I'd been and then uh, it was like oh my god what am I going to say to the guys you guys are all out there and I, I was seeing all the messages that you guys were leaving me saying you know we want to see you play after dark and I'm like what a bonehead of me so then it was like well okay um, I need to make that first video that I give you guys an update and kind of explain it and it just kind of dragged on and three weeks became four weeks and like with every day that passed it just became kind of more difficult to make that video and explain it and it just spiraled and whatever eventually what eventually kind of brought me out of it and I've really got to thank these guys is I got contacted by Warhorse Studios and uh, they're a relatively new studio they've, they've had some other games out but they've got people from like some of the really big games. They've had people who've worked on Skyrim and all kinds of stuff. And uh, they've got a, an RPG, which is it's just in a very early alpha at the moment. And uh, but I'll, I'll tell you more about that later. But anyway, I, I was talking to those guys, and I got just got really pumped up again. And I was like, okay, let's do it. And uh, so um, yeah, so I started putting this together. So uh, so there you go. So finally, I got around, and here it is. So. Let's get over that. Let's get on to what's coming up. So, first thing, City Skylines. City Skylines, uh, After Dark is out. Uh, I'm going to be finishing the Aquitania map first. Uh, and I just wanted to kind of like finish that, get that out to you guys. So, first of all, so that you can play on the map. But also, I want to start that build series. So, there's going to be a building Aquitania series. I'm going to be continuing with the uh, building London series. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about it, and I haven't got bored with it or anything. I am going to be continuing with the um, with the Building London series. But 
let's talk about oh well yeah let's talk about prison architect for a second i i'm i'm really really in two minds about prison architect um so you know what i'm going to do i'm going to put up a poll on my website uh skystorm.com there'll be a link in the in the video description uh and i want feedback from you guys about what games you want me playing right and uh, like with the last poll i'm re really going to take it from you guys what you want me to play prison architect i'm really in two minds about uh the first series was really fun really enjoyed it uh i don't know like I, I know a lot of you have been leaving me messages and saying oh come on do another prison architect series i don't know i don't know so i'm going to leave it up to the poll um so if you want more prison architect um go on the poll and, and vote for that one thing that I definitely will be playing more of is Reassembly. Because um, I only got like about halfway through that series, so I will be finishing off uh, Reassembly for sure. Polybridge. Polybridge uh, have come out with a new series of levels, and I really enjoyed playing Polybridge. So um, I definitely want to play more Polybridge. There's also um, a medieval version of Polybridge, not, not by the same developers. It's very much the same kind of idea, but it's slightly different and it's, it's kind of interesting. So um, there's a good chance of, of, of playing some of that. There are some new, really exciting games coming up. Uh, Anno, Anno 2205. I think that's going to be a pretty big game based on everything I've seen about it so far. That is definitely something that I want to do, and I'm uh, I'm waiting to uh, I'm, I am on the list <laughs> at Ubisoft uh, to get a preview copy of that. So hopefully that's going to happen. Uh, that's going to be a big thing. Uh, what else is coming up? Oh, XCOM 2. Now this is I, I really want your feedback on uh, on like XCOM 2. So I'm going to be really interested by the poll. I obviously played some uh, some XCOM, did a couple of series on uh, on XCOM like quite a long time ago now, and it was really fun. But you guys know how bad I am at XCOM, so uh, so yeah, like I, I think I'm going to play some XCOM too. I'm pretty sure I'm going to play some XCOM too. We'll kind of see how much of it. But again, you know, like if you really want me playing XCOM or you really don't want me to play XCOM, then uh, then you've got the poll. You can give me your feedback. Uh, what is, oh, 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 now, I played uh, some, I did play uh, some Total War, and, and I've been a big fan of the Total War series for a long time, and coming out very soon is Total War Warhammer. Now, Warhammer, I used to play, like, tabletop Warhammer back in the day. Uh, I love Warhammer, and the combination of Total War and Warhammer just looks so exciting, looks freaking awesome I can't wait to get my hands on that so I'm really hoping that I'm gonna be playing that as well and I hope that you guys want me to play that I know a lot of you have asked me to do um, uh, a total war uh, uh, let's play so uh, yeah I'm pretty sure I'm pretty certain that that's gonna happen because I really want to get hold of that now I mentioned that RPG game earlier it's called uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance and it's being produced by um, an indie studio, uh, really bunch of nice guys. I was um, Skyping with them uh, yesterday, uh, and they were telling me all about the game and, and like how it came to be. And uh, it's it's crowdfunded. It was funded on uh, on Kickstarter. They've raised like two million dollars, uh, it, and it's it's got an awesome potential. It's very much like a kind of uh, Skyrim type of game uh, but without like there's no magic and there's no dragons it's set in um, it's set in the late middle ages it's set in the 15th century in Europe uh, it's very very real the combat system is kind of awesome I think uh, or it could be I, I really want to play more with it uh, and, 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 and kind of follow it through the development so I'm kind of definitely going to be doing some stuff with it it's in very early alpha as I said and they're just kind of releasing the the basic features in a, in, a, in a fairly basic world. It looks gorgeous, I have to say. It really does look gorgeous, even in these early stages. Um, but there's still a hell of a lot of work to do. And it, they're looking to release the actual game uh, kind of summer next year, summer 2016. Uh, and I, I just want to kind of follow that development and look at the new features as they're releasing them. But obviously it's uh, like an RPG, is something completely new for the, for the channel. It's always been about, you know, pretty much about building games. Okay, one or two little exceptions like XCOM, but 
Um, so yeah, that, that Kingdom Come Deliverance. That's definitely something uh, that we're going to be playing around with. What else? There are so many other games. There are a lot of other uh, like building games that I've been either 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 given or gifted or whatever. There's building games like uh, Train Fever. Uh, or, or even Cities in Motion 2. There are manufacturing games like uh, Softwareing, uh, which i got to say, I, I, I kind of like the idea of playing Softwareing. That looks pretty good. Um, there's things, uh, other building games like uh, uh, Grand Ages Rome. Uh, I got gifted by somebody. Oh, there was a, another developer that sent me a couple of their games called uh, Valhalla Hills uh, and Bounty Train. And Valhalla Hills, I have to say, um, that, that might be quite fun to play. So I'll be putting all of those up on the, on the poll. I'm not going to be able to get to like everything, and there is so much coming out that it, it is going to be a case of choosing which ones uh, you know I want to play and which ones you want me to play. So I'll put that list together. That poll will be up. Go vote. Uh, what else? What else? I, you know, I think that's kind of it. Uh, but I think you can tell that, you know, I am back, I am pumped, I am excited about this. There's so much cool stuff to do. So, um, you know what, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to leave it for you guys to tell me what you think. Daily videos coming up from tomorrow. I'm going to go start working on them. I will catch you soon, guys. I am so happy to be back. I'll see you soon. Peace out. <laughs>